Do you like them? No, no, I need fish fingers and custard. Not scared. You must be out of a spare crack in your wall. I'll keep it for later. If you knock this wall down, the crack would say properly the crack isn't in the wall. Two parts of space and time that should never have touched. The engines are phasing! Can I come? Give me five minutes. I'll be right back. Trust me, I'm the doctor. Amelia, little Scottish girl, where is she? Amelia Vaughan hasn't lived here in a long time. How long? Six months. I'm not six months late, I'm 12 years late. Right? Well, why did you say five minutes? You're Amelia. You're late. Who are you? You know who I am. No, really. Catch. I'm a doctor. I'm a time traveler. Look at it, fresh as the day you gave it to me. And you know it's the same one. What do we do? Stop that now. Oh, uh, this is Rory. He's a boyfriend. Kind of boyfriend. Amy. The universe is cracked. Pandora will open. Silence will fall. Hello. I'm the doctor. Run. Oh, you sexy thing. Sorry about running off earlier. Brand new TARDIS. Come with me. Where? Wherever you like. 14 years. 14 years since fish custard. Amy Pond, the girl who waited, you've waited long enough. All of time and space, everything that ever happened or ever will. Where do you want to start? I started to think that maybe you were just like a madman with a box. I am definitely a madman with a box. <laughs> Goodbye, Ledworth. Hello, everything. <laughs> Amy, Winston Churchill. Our new secret weapon. I am the Doctor, and you are the Dark. I created you! We created you! You will never defeat us, Doctor! We will ah, return! They can't! They can't have got away from me again! You didn't know them, Amy. You'd never seen them before, and you should have done them. Oh, <gasps> Follow that ship! Call that flying the TARDIS, Amy Pond. Professor Rivers, time travel. We keep meeting in the wrong order. What do you know of the Weeping Angels? Is Rivers song your wife? Every statue in this maze, every single one, is a Weeping Angel. There's one thing you never put in a trap if you're smart, if you value your continued existence, if you have any plans about seeing tomorrow. There's one thing you never ever put in a trap. And what would that be, sir? Me. That's, that's, that's like the crack from my bedroom wall when I was a little girl. Yes. How could it be here? I don't know yet, but I'm working it out. Oh, what is that? The date of the explosion where the crack begins. Who is time? Cracks, cracks in time. She didn't recognize the Daleks. Time can be unwritten. It's the crack in my wall. How could it be following me? River Song. She killed a man. Who? It's a long story, Doctor. I'm getting married in the morning. It's you. It's all about you. And for those of us who can't read the base code of the universe... It is time. <laughs> Rory! You know what's dangerous about you? It's not that you make people take risks. It's that you make them want to impress you. You have no idea how dangerous you make people to themselves when you're around. Why are you here? We ran from the silence. The silence? There were cracks. Through some, we really saw silence. And the end of all things. Have you met monsters before? Yeah. You scared of them? No, they're scared of me. <gasps> Not here. Not now. Some sort of space-time cataclysm, an explosion maybe. Big enough to put cracks in the universe. <laughs> Doctor! <laughs> Time energy catches up with you, you'll never have been born. It will erase every moment of your existence. You will never have lived at all. I am not leaving him. We have to. No! I'm sorry. Get off me! I'm sorry. Get off me! No! 
Help! If his body's absorbed, I'll forget him. He'll never have existed. Rory's only alive in your memory. You must keep hold of him. Don't let anything distract you. Rory still lives in your mind. <laughs> what were you saying? What is this? It does have a title. The Pandorica opens. What is it? A box, a cage, a prison. It was built to contain the most feared thing in all the universe. And anything that powerful I'd know about it. Why don't I know? These stones are great big transmitters broadcasting a warning to everyone, everywhere, to every time zone. The Pandorica is opening. Everything that's ever hated you is coming here tonight. They're all here, all of them, all for you. What could you possibly be? If something can be remembered, it can come back. Hello, Amy. But you died. How can you be here? What's your name? Rory. How could she not remember me? Because you never existed. Who are those Romans? Hello, Stonehenge! Remember, every black day I ever stopped you. Oh, no! Do the smart thing! Let somebody else try first. They're not real. They can't be. They're all in a book in Amy's house. It's a trap. It has to be. Plastic Romans. Duplicates. Listen to me. You have to run. Have a thing. I'll kill you. Just go! There's something wrong with the TARDIS. Something else is controlling it. 26th of June, 2010. A scenario was devised from the memories of your companion. Rory Williams from Ledworth. My boyfriend. How could I ever forget you? The cracks in time are the work of the Doctor. The Pandorica is ready! Ready for what? Ready for you! Every sun will swoop and over every moment in history. The whole universe will never have existed. Listen to me! Rory! Listen, she's not dead. You need to get me out of Pandorica. Where's Amy? I killed her. Can you help her? Is there anything you can do? This box is the ultimate prison. You can't even escape by dying. It forces you to stay alive. This box needs a guard. I killed the last one. However bored you get, stay out of... Trouble! Oh. Ah, two of you. Come along, Pons. If all the stars that ever were are gone, then what is that? I'm sorry, my love. I'm that's sorry. that's River. She is right at the heart of the explosion. Hi, honey. I'm home. What in the name of sanity have you got on your head? It's a fez. I wear a fez now. Fezzes are cool. Oh! The box contains a memory of the universe, and the light transmits the memory, and that's how we're going to do it. Do what? Reboot the universe. TARDIS is still burning. It's exploding at every point in history. If you threw the Pandorica into the explosion, right into the heart of the fire... Then what? The light from the Pandorica would explode everywhere at once. He's going to fly the Pandorica into the heart of the explosion. Big Bang too. Try and remember your family and they'll be there. How can I remember them if they never existed? You brought Rory back, you can bring them back too. Geronimo. I escaped then. I'm rewinding my, my, my time stream. <laughs> Amelia's house. The night she waited. There'll be a story in your head. We're all stories in the end. Just make it a good one, eh? Bye-bye, Bond. Do you feel like there's a great big thing in your head and you feel like you should remember it, but you can't? Raggedy man, I remember you and you are late for my wedding! Hello, everyone. I'm Amy's imaginary friend. But I came anyway. A date, a time, a map reference. I think it's an invitation. Dr. Song, sir, says she's going to some planet called America. Howdy! Doctor! <laughs> it's the Song! I wear a Stetson now. Stetsons are cool. <laughs> Hello, sweetie. I've been running. The fastest than I've ever run. Oh, my God. Now it's time for me to stop. It's okay. I know it's you. Baby! <laughs> 
I'm sorry. No! Stop! Stop! Why did you come? Same reason as you. Who did the doctor trust the most? The doctor we saw on the beach is a future version. 200 years older than the one up there. But all that's still gonna happen. We're still gonna die. What the hell is that? I'm going to need a swap team, pot of coffee, 12 jammy dodgers and a fez. We can only remember you while we're seen. Is that it? Doctor, I'm pregnant. That's it. The astronaut. Help me! I'm sorry. I didn't mean to shoot you. Science will fall! You're acting like we've never done that before. We haven't. It's the first time for everything. And our last time. So, this little girl, it's all about her. Who was she? I can't tell it. This is future. I know. You're the TARDIS. Yes, I just wanted to say. Hello, Doctor. It's so very, very nice to meet you. I love you. The flesh. It's fully programmable matter. It's alive, so alive. You're piling your lives, your personalities directly into it. So there's a woman I keep seeing, a woman with an eye patch, and she has this habit of sliding walls open and, and staring at me. Time memory, like a mirage. There's nothing to worry about. <gasps> what is happening to her? Contractions. Contractions? She's going into labor. I needed enough information to block the signal to the flesh. What signal? The signal to you. We're coming for you, I swear it, whatever happens. However hard, however far, we will find you. I'm right here. No, you're not. And you haven't been for a long, long time. You're ready to pop, aren't you? The whole time I thought I was on the TARDIS. I was really here. They've taken Amy and our baby. We're going after her. This is the day he finds out who I am. Good men don't need rules. Today is not the day to find out why I have so many. Hello, Melody Pond. Is Melody human? Oh, she is. Look closer. Human plus Time Lord. What is she? Hope in this endless, bitter war. Against who? Against you, Doctor. And now they've taken a child, and they're going to turn her into a weapon just to bring you down. Who are you? Why are you in prison? Who did you kill? Tell me who you are. I am telling you. Rory and Amy, I know where to find your daughter, and on my life she will be safe. The doctor will find your daughter, and he will care for her whatever it takes. It's me. I'm your daughter. Have you found Melody? You know who she grows up to be. So you know I will find her. But you haven't yet. I'm the best mate. Then why don't I know you? Bells. Short for... Melody. You got to raise me after all. You're a Melody. Ah! <gasps> oh, I was born to kill the Doctor. Demons run. Remember? This is what they were building. According to our records, the woman who kills the Doctor. Who wants me dead? The silence. What is the silence? The silence is not a species. It is a religious order or movement. Their core belief is that silence will fall when the question is asked. What question? Unknown. The, the river that we know in the future, she is in prison for murder. Whose murder? I stole your childhood and now I've led you by the hand to your death. Yeah, but the worst thing is I knew. I knew this would happen. This is what always happens. I'm not a hero. I really am just a madman in a box. It's time to stop waiting. Real, real house, real doggies. You're leaving, aren't you? Why now? Because you're still breathing. You can't just drop me off at my house and say goodbye like we shared a cab. And what's the alternative? Me standing over your grave? doing he's saving us you never really escaped us melody pond how do you know who i am i made you what you are 
the woman who kills the doctor. Hello, sweetie. What have you done? Fixed points can be rewritten. Of course they can't. Who told you that? Time is dying because of you. Because I refuse to kill the man I love. I'll suffer if I have to kill you. More than every living thing in the universe. Yes. I just told you my name. Melody Pond. You're the woman who married me. This world is dying and it's my fault. There isn't another way. Then you may kiss the bride. The doctor is dead. Of course he isn't. Would you have possibly escaped? The Tesselector. A doctor in a doctor's suit. Barely got singed in that boat. All still waiting for you. The fields of Trenzalore, the fall of the Eleventh, and the question that must never be answered. Doc! Tor! Who? Must be people who love you, friends. No, well, yes, but they all think I'm dead. You can't let them think that you're dead, not at Christmas. It's complicated, very but complicated. You must Far go too complicated. tell them explain right now. at once. You don't want to be all wet on a night like this. You're not dead. And a happy new year. River told us. <laughs> How much trouble are we in? Out of ten? Eleven. What do you know of the Dalek Asylum? Hello! Yes! Do you read me? Oswin Oswald. Junior Entertainment Manager, Starship Alaska. Current status crashed and shipwrecked somewhere not nice. What have you been doing on your own against the Daleks? Making souffles? You coming to get me? Amy, you kicked me out! You want kids! You have always wanted kids! I can't have them! Where am I? Where am I? Because you are a Dalek. They did a full conversion. I am Oswin Oswald. I fought the Daleks and I am... Human! Run, you clever boy. And remember... How's the job? I gave it up. You gave the last one up. Yeah, well, I can't settle. Every minute I'm listening out for that stupid TARDIS. Set. Right, so it's my fault now, is it? I, I just worry there'll come a time when you never turn up, that something will have happened to you and I'll still be waiting, never knowing. You'll be there till the end of me. Or vice versa. We could save everyone right now. This is not how we roll and you know it. Don't you see? Every time I negotiate, I try to understand. Well, not today. No. Today, I honor the victims first. His, the masters, the Daleks, all the people who died because of my mercy. See, this is what happens when you travel alone for too long. You think it's been ten years? Not for you or Earth, but for us. Ten years older, ten years of you. On and off. You're thinking of stopping, aren't you? The traveling has started to feel like running away. I'm not running away from things, I'm running to them before they flare and fade forever. Then why do you keep coming back for us? Because you were the first face this face saw, and you were seared onto my hearts. I'm running to you and Rory before you fade from me. Go save every world you can find. Who else has that chance? Just bring them back safe. Weeping angels. That's what happened to Rory. Well, we're gonna get there somehow. We're in the rest of the book. No! Stop! You can't read ahead. Once we know what's coming, it's written in stone. Doctor, what is it? What's wrong? Tell me. He doesn't like endings. Rory. I'm sorry, Rory, but you just died. What are you doing? If I die now, it's a paradox, right? The paradox killed the angels. Together, or not at all. What the hell are you doing? Changing the future. Amen! Hey, it's working! The paradox is working! Oh. The gravestone here for someone with the same name as me. Doctor! I'm so, so sorry. One more paradox. Would rip New York apart. The angel, would it send me back to the same time to him? I will never be able to see you again. I'll be fine. I'll be with him. Come on, pond, please. Raggedy man, goodbye. No! I'll tell her to write an afterword. For you. Hello, old friend. By the time you read these words, Rory and I will be long gone. Know that we will love you, always. And do one more thing for me. There's a little girl waiting in a garden. Tell her that if she's patient, the days are coming that she'll never forget. This is the story of Amelia Pond, and this is how it ends.
What's your name? Clara. It's the same story every time, and it always begins with the same two words. Doctor Who? Do you actually live up here on a cloud in a box? I have done for a long time now. Is there a kitchen? I like making souffles. Souffles? What's this? Me. Giving in. This is the day! Everything begins! <gasps> I never knew her name, her full name. Oswin Oswald, junior entertainment manager, Starship Alaska. It was her. Her own new clever boy. And she died both times. The same woman. But where are you going? To find Clara. Hello? Ah, oh, hello. I can't find the internet. What's the password for the internet? Run, you clever boy and... Remember. Hello? Clara Oswin Oswald. Just Clara Oswald. What was that middle one? You and me inside that box now. I'm sorry. Yes, it's a space. Yes, it's bigger on the inside. No, I don't have time to talk about it. Please tell me what is happening! Ha, I'm the doctor. I'm an alien from outer space. I'm a thousand years old. I've got two hearts and I can't fly a plane. It is not a snog box. I'll be the judge of that. Starting when? Come back tomorrow. Why? Because tomorrow I might say yes. Right then, Clara Oswald. Time to find out who you are. She's just a girl. Look at she be? She can't be. She's not possible. Where do you want to go? Hey? What do you want to see? Something awesome. Welcome to the rooms of Akita. I have seen things you wouldn't believe. I have lost things you will never understand. And I know things, secrets that must never be told, knowledge that must never be spoken. You have it all! What more can you need? The most important leaf in human history. It's full of stories. I'm full of a future that never got lived. And these are all my mums. Impossible girl. Mystery wrapped in an enigma, squeezed into a skirt that's just a little bit too tight. What are you? His friends are lost forevermore, unless he goes to Trenzalore. He can't go there, you know he can't. Which well, definitely Trenzalore. Yeah, what is Trenzalore? Where I'm buried. Clara, he can't see or hear me, only you can. River. That can't be right. Maybe it's a secret entrance to the tomb! The telepathic circuits are awakening memories you shouldn't even have. The Dalek Asylum, there was a girl in a shipwreck and she died saving my life, and she was you! That is not a conversation you should even what remember. What do you mean I died? What's that? My own personal time tunnel. I can rewrite your every living moment. Simeon is attacking his entire timeline. He's dying all at once in the Dalek Asylum. Now he's dying in one with us. I have to go in there. I'm the impossible girl. And this is why. It's the only way to save him, isn't it? Run, you clever boy. And remember me. I don't know where I am. Always I'm running to save the Doctor again and again and again. But I've always been there. Don't steal that one, steal this one. The navigation system's knackered, but you'll have much more fun. You can't go in there. It's your own time stream, for God's sake. I'm not really here. You are always here to me. It's hard to leave when you haven't said goodbye. Goodbye. Sweetie. Let me save you! Who's that? He is my secret. What I did, I did without choice. But not in the name of the Doctor. He was the Doctor who fought in the Time War, and that was the day he did it. Geronimo! Doctor! Wait! You're not. How can you be here? I'm... Looking for the doctor. You certainly come to the right place. Did you ever count? Count what? How many children there were on Gallifrey that day? I have absolutely no idea. 2.47 billion. You forgot? 400 years, is that all it takes? I moved on. No, 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 for once I would like to know where I'm going. No, you really wouldn't. You were the doctor on the day it wasn't possible to get it right. You don't have to do it alone. What is it, what? I never pictured you doing it that's all then what do i do what you've always done be a doctor we're going to freeze gallifrey Geronimo! i saw trenzalore where we're buried 
That's not how it's supposed to be. That's how the story ends. Nothing we can do about it. Clara sometimes asks me if I dream. I dream about where I'm going. Home. The long way round. Daleks, Sontarans, Terileptils, Slovene, and they're not even fighting. What does this message mean? Papal mainframe. It's like a great big flying church. What's wrong? It's only a crack in the wall. What is it? A split in the skin of reality. A tiny sliver of the 26th of June, 2010, the day the universe blew up. Analysis of message composition indicates Gallifreyan origin. The message is a request for information. The oldest question in the universe. Doctor, who? This planet, what's it called? Transalore. Speak your name and this world will burn. I dedicate this church to one cause. Silence. The doctor will not speak his name. Silence will fall. Where have you been for 300 years? I'm an old man now. But you don't die. You change. I can't ever do it again. This is where I end up. Why did you ever come to Trenzalore? Well, I did come to Trenzalore and nothing can change that now. The Kavarian chapter broke away. They travel back along your timeline and tried to prevent you ever reaching Trenzalore. So that's who blew up my TARDIS. Created the very cracks in the universe through which the Time Lords are now calling. They engineered a psychopath to kill you. Totally married her. We saw the future, Clara. This is how it ends. Listen to me, you lot. Listen! You've been asking a question. And it's time someone told you you've been getting it wrong. His name is the Doctor. Or the name he needs. Everything you need to know about him. Help him. Emergency! Emergency! The Doctor is regenerating! The Doctor is regenerating! From Gallifrey, boys! just disappears, doesn't it? Everything you are, gone in a moment, like breath on a mirror. But times change, and so must I. Amelia! Who is Amelia? The first face this face saw. We all change, and that's okay, that's good. You've got to keep moving, so long as you remember all the people that you used to be. I will always remember when the Doctor was me. Raggedy man. Good night.